part of one of the most prestigious tournaments up and down the East Coast, talking about JCW and the J Cup. And then when I get here, they tell me that my opponents tonight, the DOD and Ace Darling, somehow, some way, found a way to finagle their way out. And I know John Shane had something to do about it. But I will not let this opportunity pass me by. It's an honor and a privilege for Stryker to be part of such a great tournament with so many great names. Talking about guys like CM Punk, Slick Wagner Brown, Dave Greco, Alex Shelley, Jimmy Jacobs. The list goes on and on. Don't forget about me, Ace Darling, John Shane. Don't forget about Stryker. Striker, you want a match tonight, Striker? You're challenging me, Striker. Look, man, Ace is in the hospital, all right? He's sick. He can't wrestle. But you calling out John Shane? You're calling me out? Well, I got a surprise for you, Striker. I got the surprise from England. I got Johnny Storm, the Wonder Kid, and he's going to take care of you. Tell him about it, Johnny. Well, first of all, do you really think that I need to fly 4,000 miles to your country, Striker, to lose? Who the hell do you think you are? I'm a winner. I'm the best England has to offer. And if I have to come to your country and beat your ass in the middle of that ring, then that's exactly what the Wonder Kid does. Because I'm Johnny Storm, and you're not. You're ready. Ladies and gentlemen, our next contest is scheduled for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Making his way to the ring first, from New York City, New York, weighing in at 225 pounds, Stryker! Right. Well, Lloyd, as we all take a moment to catch our breath, this should be a treat, because Stryker made a challenge to John Shane, and I, from the looks of things, Shane accepted. And I don't know what Shane's got up his sleeve here, but... Boy, would I love to see Stryker and John Shane one-on-one. -on -one. And his opponent, from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 220, 30 pounds, the sure thing, John Shane. Well, John Shane about to make his singles wrestling debut in JCW, and oh, oh, and look at this. Why am I not surprised? back out of this match. Striker doesn't look like the looks of this, and neither do I. There would be nothing that would make me happy than to get in this ring and show you what a great wrestler John Shane is. Right. But unfortunately, I was in the back warming up and I was doing a squat thrust and I severely tore my hamstring very badly, Stryker. And, and man, you know, as much as I, what are you smiling at? I'm hurt. No, I'm not lying. I'm telling the truth. I have never lied in my life as I'm not lying now when I say you're the ugliest man in this building. Now sit down. Now, now, I want to give you a match, Stryker, because I think these people deserve a match. And I apologize to the good people of Garfield. And if I was able, I'd show this man a lesson in wrestling. But, but, I got a replacement for you. I made a phone call and I got a replacement. I don't know if I can even get up on this. Hope, watch out, please. I can't too get it up, Stryker. Ask your sister. Oh. My leg, my leg, my leg, my leg. That's a little uncalled for. My leg, my leg, my leg. So, sit down! Sit down! Sit down! Get security, security please. Please, security. As I said before you interrupted me, Stryker, 
I want to get you a match. So I made a phone call, and I want to bring him out right now. From Essex, England, the Wonder Kid, Johnny Storm. Well, Shane Style in action. has wussed out here. I don't buy this injury stuff for a minute, but he found a replacement from Essex, England, the, the Wonder Kid, Johnny Starr. John Shane wants no part of Stryker. And I'm not going to fault him for that, but then he shouldn't have agreed to the match. Ah, uh, Stryker, Stryker, Stryker. Stryker, Stryker, Stryker. And we're underway here. Stryker looking for a handshake. He's, he's not going to get it, apparently. Yeah, I'm deaf from, from Johnny Belgium. Starr. It's all right. Hold on. What'd you say? I'm a little deaf right now. Thank you for ringing the bell right in my ear. And Johnny Starr, with, oh, look at this. Going right to work here. Nice flying head scissor there. And this will be the first JCW appearance for Johnny Starr. Stryker was supposed to compete tonight in a six-man tag. He was going to be partnered up with Los Boricuas against Ace Darling and the DOD. And Ace, unfortunately, injured himself. No. We all, all, all our best days, Ace. Ace. all our love to you, all our prayers and hopes with you. Hope you get better. Unlike John Shane's fictional I'm injury. To say, John Shane, we're thinking about you. Yeah. Even though you're down there and we're up here, we're thinking about you. Right, Berkey? No. Un unlike the fictional injury of John Shane, fictional. which I don't buy for a second. Limping, yeah, I saw it. You can fake a limp like that. I think he's mastered that fake limp over many years. But unlike that, Ace Darling is legitimately in the hospital and we do extend our best wishes for a quick recovery to ace our jcw champion and so earlier on we saw a tag team title match between the dod and los boricuas and well lord what a start that got the night off to i mean who expected to see never mind both but either either one of the two teams that came back tonight in the dirty rotten scoundrels and the solution all right i don't know but obviously and he's from England, so, you know, I really can't say anything because England's kind of close to Scotland. In fact, they're on the same island, so. Take down here by Starr. Shoulders down, cover. Striker gets shoulder up and gets up with the bridge now. And, folks, what a night it's been. I mean, this is J-Cup 4. This has been an unbelievable tournament. This match is not a part of the Jacob tournament, of course. And look at these guys jockeying for position here. And oh, nice move by Stryker. The finals of the Jacob are upcoming. Jay Lethal to take on Homicide. And what a match that should be. And once again, Stryker looking for the handshake. And now, oh, Stryker ducks the clothesline here. Star lands on his feet, but Stryker, uh -oh. oh. Can't Hold seem to back. get a hold on him. I don't know. This guy just keeps landing on his feet. Reversal here. Got him up again. Oh, oh. and that time he lands it. Nicely done. Oh. oh, what a boot to the face by Stryker. Looks like Stryker was getting a bit, you know, angry. <laughs> Looks like he was getting a bit antsy. And oh, wait a minute. Oh, you see John Shane run up to the apron right there? What? He didn't look so hurt there. What? 
And there's Johnny Starr using the chair behind the ref's back. Hold on, what just happened? I was looking the other way. As the ref was distracted by a suddenly mobile John Shane. John Shane's mobile? They got him in the ambulance? Oh, he's right there at ringside. Where? I have to see. Yeah. Oh, look at that leg. He looks like he's in so much pain. Double reversal here. and oh. Slam down is striker. Two count only there. And Johnny Starr looking for a oh, jawbreaker there. What did he say? He said it's finished. He said it's finished. What is And we're going to see what he's got. Oh, look at that. Making something? That could do it. No. Oh. Striker kicks out. And it remains to be seen, Lord, whether this Johnny Starr is a permanent addition to John Shane's managerial stable. Well, John Shane always has a habit of picking very good talent, so he wouldn't have picked this guy unless he knew he could work. And here comes Starr. He misses. Striker rolls out of the way. Quick arm drag by Striker. And another one. And a big drop kick. Striker, as a wrestler, Lord, represents a complete package. Uh, he's, a, he's a very compact combination of strength and speed, but John Shane getting involved again. He pulls the leg of Striker. Oh, oh now my leg, sure. Well, you know, legs, leg injuries act up. You know, so you could be feeling really good one second and then really bad the next. You know, it doesn't have to hurt all the time. It's or you could be scared of getting in the ring against an athlete like Striker, and you can fake a hamstring John, injury. What the heck are you talking about? John Shane and I have, have walked through the streets of the South Bronx by ourselves without weapons and have lived to tell the tale. John Shane and I walked through the streets of Baghdad with our heads held high. Waving, Baghdad, huh? American flags and I'll sit down, power bomb here, one, two. Striker gets the shoulder up. That's, that's how brave we are. Little do you know, Berkowitz. And Johnny Starr in control of this one at the moment. Star is playing up to the ground a little bit. <laughs> Referee warning him. Irish whip here, striker against the ropes. He ducks the clothesline. And off. Nice flying forearm there by striker. <sighs> oh, and look at this striker warning John Sheen. Not to get involved. Oh, now he's crying about his leg again. Oh, and here nice. comes Starr with the front drop kick there. Kicks up. Striker to the outside. Been oh, all the way to the outside. Oh, man. Look at that. Both these guys on the outside and down now. John, John, I, I don't think you should risk your leg injury. I think you should stick this one out. Leg injury, my ass. And the referee is counting both these guys out. We've got to get this one back into the ring. And Striker back in now. And Johnny Starr follows. A cover. Two count only. Well, they say he's from England, so, you know, you got to give him a little credit. I mean, England is on the same island as Scotland. What does that mean to me? It means that, you know, he might have some of the same genes that are in my gene pool, so he actually might have some talent in him. Well, look at this. Striker, what do we have here? He's got that leg extended, looking for the tap out, and now Shane up on the apron again. Come on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's that oh, guy doing holding Shane like I that? think Striker's What's had enough. He's injured. There's no way. Striker's had enough of John out. Shane. And Oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh, he threw that. He threw some kind of white powder something and he striker he hit the wrong guy no striker threw some white powder oh come on you saw it as clear as day wait, wait a minute shane threw that powder oh, but he hit why would shane throw it on his own man obviously it had to be striker and now look at listen to wait a minute wait a minute what shane's screaming and and striker's putting on shane's jacket and <laughs> well, he's got the jacket on inside out wait a minute wait a minute what's he doing What's oh, look going? at this. What, what the hell is this? Look at... 
Wait, I don't think John Shane knows where the hell he is, but this is the most inventive, creative submission hold I think I've ever seen. He just used John Shane to pull that move off. And now Shane, oh. I don't know, get Shane out of there. He's now he's, he's clutching his shoulder too. That's my friend down there. Well, why don't you go help him out? out I'm not getting out. You think it'd be nice to get in the ring with Striker? Are you crazy? Well, Shane getting what he deserves if you ask me. And here comes Johnny Starr. Oh, oh, he lands a big DDT out of nowhere. And that could one, do it. Two, and oh, Striker gets the shoulder up. I don't see why the referee didn't disqualify Striker immediately for throwing the powder. You see Berkowitz? That striker now regaining the edge goes for the cover two. Both these guys showing a lot of resilience here. Just get the other one from him. Striker with the elbow over the back of the neck, and where's he going? Striker up top, looking for oh, whatever he's looking for, he didn't hit it. And Stryker perched up top. Here comes Johnny Starr. Look at this. Oh, oh, what a flying Hurricane Rana from the top. Beautifully executed. And that might be all. A cover, two. Oh, that's not all she wrote. She wrote a little more. Well, what a match. I'll tell you, this match is living up to some of the ones we've seen in the Jacob tournament. And, oh, here... Striker using the ropes of springboard. Oh! Oh, boy, did you see and that? And that's going to do it, but oh, oh, John Shane, John Shane picked up the, the foot of Johnny Starr and put it up on the rope there. And the match's still not over. You think Shane would have learned his lesson by now? I don't know. Wishful thinking, I guess. Oh. Well, another two count. I think this match should have been over with Striker's disqualification for throwing the powder. But John Shane threw that powder, and you Why know it. Why John Shane throw the powder on his own I man? I threw it on his own man by accident. And Stryker up, and he's going all the way up. What are we going to see here? Oh, and he misses! That was, almost high. that was almost all the way across the ring. And Stryker misses, and he gets oh. caught. Oh! I think that's that's got to do it. No. no! He's still in the fight. I don't know how the hell both of these guys keep kicking out. And now... Johnny Starr paying attention to the ref. That's not a good idea. And he gets, well, he gets thrown right up there. And oh, oh. look at that. Oh, wait. One, that's going to, oh. And he still can't get him. This, this action sometimes too quick to call. And these guys still having trouble finishing this thing off. And, well, Starr put the brakes on and lands the kick into the head. And now, oh, oh. oh. And that is going to do it. It's over. Done. It's finished. What a match. And Stryker with the victory. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the match, Stryker. Well, in spite of all the outside interference of John Shane, Stryker with the win. And Lord, what a match. And you know what's coming up next. Coming up next we have only got one match to go. Oh, I'm and I'm that match feeling. is I'm the finals. Feeling. The finals of Jacob 4, the 2003 Jacob. Last year, it was Reckless Youth and American Dragon tearing down the house. This year, Jay Lethal and the Notorious 187 homicide. Who's your money on right now? I don't know. I don't know who the hell to call. It's going to be an unbelievable final. What a match in this Jacob. Berkowitz, I couldn't have said it any better myself. Let's get ourselves ready. And wait a minute, look at this. We got to show a sportsmanship now. And oh, oh, there's the DOT. What is this? Come on. Have we had enough of this tonight? Sean Shane calling his dogs into the ring. The disciples of Darling, Static and Brolic. Oh, and look, here's the Bariquas. 
Break was coming to make the save. Well, at least they didn't play the theme music. Luckily for Stryker. I'm just glad they didn't play his damn the the well, folks, damn theme. Well, folks, the music. tag team certain right, scene certainly heating up with the return of the scoundrels and the solution, but Stryker with the win here. Los Boricos make the save. Jacob Finals, Homicide Lethal coming up next. I can't wait.